Nope, unless we get some dodges too. Let's see. 336 almost one shot at him. Very huge, a tremendous amount of damage right there. Um, hey there, ladies and gentlemen. It is Wiz. Welcome back for another FFT AI battle. So, we have top and bottom, we actually have two new teams. The top team is actually something I just made up like 10 minutes ago called Streamers or Babies. And then on the bottom, we have Cassius' team, which is uh, called Sweet Dreams. So, uh, for my team, we have Stream the Monk, Ghost, Ghost of the Ninja, Sniper the Ninja, and Victim the Mime. Uh, now, for Cassie and this team, uh, Sweet Dreams, we have Morpheus the Ninja, Somnus the Priest, Hypnos the Ninja, and Pasatia the Priest. So, um, two sets of twins. Um, I believe Castia told me in a video in particular that Two Hands does work with Morningstar. Um, I just don't remember how potent it's going to be. Uh, looks like these units have bad compat overall, specifically the priests have bad compat with this mime, so not a ton of damage. Um, I kind of got around the loophole of, uh, some monks, um, how do I say, with monks having, uh, innate martial arts and a, and a same with mimes having innate martial arts i thought i could gonna get around um just having attack up uh for fist damage it'll still do a lot of damage in general same with punch art it'll do slightly less it's a 33 percent multiplier four-thirds multiplier attack up that is versus uh martial arts which is one fifth so i just want to kind of test it out and see how it goes um but uh yeah let's kind of get this ball rolling then um I have no idea what the synergies are going to be like. Let's just uh, see if there's a bloodbath. Oh, I'll also just point out too, you can see everybody's HP is pretty low. The only two people are the Monk and the Mime who have above 300 HP. So I'm expecting these rounds to go by very quickly one way or the other. Um, as for the map, let's go to the public cemetery. Hmm. Oh yeah, I... Don't know who's going to be taking this one. Like I said, I wanted to kind of experiment with uh, an attack up ninja, with uh, even without weapons, because of the quadratic formula as fists. 15 PA with attack up, he'll still do a ton of damage. Um, I can't remember which one. I believe it's Sniper. I believe Sniper is the one with... Um, uh, yeah, I believe Sniper is the one with um, attack up. Uh, I think that was 189. Ah, uh, he couldn't mimic it. That's too bad. All right. Um, I remember that these ninjas probably do have throws. Yeah, he took 180 damage. He should be in range, unless we get a Mimic Darabon. All right, hits one person. Okay. Um, let's see what happens here. And a kill shot right off the bat. Fortunately, the positioning works out in uh, my favor a little bit. Um, all right, so it looks like this mime is not in range. Remember, he's got talk skill. Who sleeps? Ah, uh, hits him even with bad compad. That's unfortunate. Um, let's see what happens here. I'm guessing a uh, wave fist. Yeah, so he he. Uh, that's our martial arts guy. Um, wow, so two ninjas dead instantly, and it's very unfortunate that uh, none of the evasion triggered right there. Now they're able to bring them back unless we get like a kill shot, punch. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> I did not expect that. Oh, come on. Ray Repeating Fist is such a gamble. Oh, man. I thought that was like melee damage, and it wasn't. So now both ninjas are back up. He went for Repeating Fist. <laughs> now he puts him down, but oh. He should have just went for punches. He could have done some guaranteed damage, and now he's probably dead here. Let's see if I'm right. Oh, the random damage came in the play. Did not kill, fortunately. Uh, let's see. 135. Uh, unless I get lucky with RNG again, but I don't think that's going to happen. Um, yeah, so these ninjas are just cleaning a house right now. Um, random damage, is it going to kill? Oh, Blake has saved his life. Holy shit. Very nice. 384, wow. These ninjas are just mowing down people. It's insane. 140, pretty good. And then we're probably going to see an Earth Slash return. <laughs> wow, three, yeah, 329. Very good damage right there. Holy crap. Um... Yeah, I kind of feel like I should have given this monk battle song instead. He didn't even use time magic, and I just want to make sure he has haste learned, right? Yeah, he just went for damage that first turn. I think I might have been better off using battle song, but it's all good. You get at least one application of it off. 
Um, let's go to the Grog Hill, map number 81. So we're probably going to be seeing some Earth Flashes first turn immediately, especially from the Monk having 9 speed versus Ninja's base 11 speed. And with the positioning, um, the Mime might be able to get some Mimics in, like some Mimic Earth Slashes. It won't hit the Priests because, remember, they have Float, so there won't be any friendly fire. Mimic Derma? Thankfully for me, it doesn't uh, trigger off the bat. Um, well, he's going to be put on res duty instantaneously. Not good. Um, another Mimic Derma? Oh! 20 Brave? Okay, well, fortunately, that was the one... Um, wait, hold on. She should be going for Revival. Yeah. Okay. And a three-man don't act. Ooh, that's not good. Ah, uh, that's too bad. Paralyze? Monk has a uh, defense arm lit. All right. I missed uh, the mime, but it kind of makes sense with bad compat. Race two? Okay. Mime is in range to do some good damage. We, we sh oh, wait, hold on. 32? Yeah, and the, the flails are not doing their thing. Two hands, it does double that damage, but uh, just did not come into play. Um, bad idea, especially on that kind of unit. Um, he's He has... Um, he could just go for, like, a way fist and do some very good damage. He just neglected to not do that. Um, so both the mimes are dead. Or both the ninjas. Alright, so one of my ninjas is fortunately alive still. He's able to do damage in one shot. Yeah. Again, the very low HP pulls are the reason why this is able to happen. Um, yeah, the haste, the one turn haste was pretty nice because it allowed um, my units just to get double turns. And unfortunately, the don't acts are really screwing everything up. Hopefully my mind can get a turn off. Um, before one of these ninjas does. Alright, well, unfortunately the ninjas are the threat here. They could one-shot, let's see. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, well, alright, so the revival duty is being prioritized right now. Um, yeah, the, pro the revival duty is being prioritized, which is lucky for me. Um, let's see here. Oh, two, okay. Damage split did not trigger, but it wasn't even necessary. Oh my gosh. Just the complete slaughter from these ninjas. Holy shit. One, all right, so... Yeah, pretty good heals. Not, nothing really to complain about. Um, will this kill? Oh, <laughs> nope. Now if he dodges a 20% item. Okay. All right, well, this he should be dead in return. Yeah, 200 damage punches, 400. My god. This is a complete slugfest. Holy shit. That is absolutely something. Um, just for the hell of it, I want to try... I want to try this guy. I want to do these again, but I want to try... Um, I want to try uh, Battle Song and see how much of a difference that makes, if it makes any at all. So we're just going to do this for the hell of it. Try to give Castia like, a bit of a rematch. Let's see. Cemetery. <clears> hmm. <throat> Because, yeah, the, the haste team would come into the play of the first round at all. I think they were in range. Like, the ninjas moved, and then my monk moved immediately. So let's see what happens here. We might get, like, the same outcome. Let's just come and find out. Because, yeah, that was a really quick um, quick set of rounds. Um, yeah, he's probably going to go for a one-turn Earth Slash. Let's just uh, see if we can get something slightly different. Um, but, yeah, let's find out. Um, I... And we had RNG, like repeating fists and all that stuff. Yeah, looks like the same thing is going to take place. 140. Okay. Yeah, same opening moves. Not too bad. Again, I think it's just the placement of the map in particular. Um, but it, it might it might have an impact later on. We'll, we'll see. Yeah, Yega Yu Darkness missing. Not good. Um, 140, pretty good. Yeah, everything's looking the exact same so far. Unless we get some RNG. Nope, unless we get some dodges too. Let's see. 336 almost one shot at him. Very huge, a tremendous amount of damage right there. Um, does not kill him, but very close. And she's probably going to try to go for a heal. The ninjas might be fast enough to kill him off before he gets his turn. Yep, not bad. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing that's another Earth Slash. Yep. All right, so 
yeah, both of those ninjas are immediately taken down. And it worked a little bit that um, mine getting hit in critical because he's running away towards his companions who all have healing. You know, two people, uh, the monk, let's see, very, very, a ton of damage. And ah, oh, the, the placement unfortunately couldn't hit someone else. All right. Um, Ninja's just going to put that shit down immediately or try to. Um, Earth Slash, yeah. I was hoping that he would get revived or healed up, but it looks like they're uh, not going for that whatsoever. Um, yeah, I, I'm not sure if the ninja is going to be able to get his turn off. Let's see. Going for a kill? Yep, the Blade Guy saved her life, so that's a this is a bit different. Um, unfortunately, Earth Slash doesn't trigger here. So the ninjas are back up and running. Um, let's see. 216? Yep, Blade Grass can't dodge that. Let's see what this ninja does. He might get a kill. Let's see. Or go for Mimic Derevan. That's a waste of a turn. Because they both could have gangbanged that one ninja, but they did not do that. 320, pretty good damage. Yeah, so... Um, I, I, wait, 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 let's see. Yeah, with the low HP pool, those ninjas, it's it's essentially 2v2. Um, Mimic Dervon? It does connect this time, and this is massive. Um, yeah, this is really good for Castia right now. Because there's the constant uh, raise twos. Um, the priests are just bringing everybody back to life instantaneously because of the good compats. Um, and unfortunately, with this Mime and Critical, he's just uh, running around not doing anything. See, it's up to a single ninja. Yeah. Unless we can get like some mid charges, but again, I don't even think it matters. Because yeah, if you get blocks like that, it's just a numbers game. Race 2 is really effective in these kind of instances, uh, as opposed to like... <laughs> 6 to Yeah, the 50% damage multiplier. Oh my god. <laughs> the two of them just did over a 1,000 damage right there. Holy shit. Uh, wow, this is... Uh, turned to be a bit of a disaster for me. Wow. This one, yeah, so I don't even think the battle song made all that difference, uh, that much of a difference. I think what was unfortunate there was that this mime, with him being in critical, it was basically a 3v4, and these priests, um, raise two, just being able to bring somebody back to full life, there's only so much you can do with single target damage. And some of those blade grass came into play too, which are very nice. It could be the difference between somebody living and dying. With them getting blade grass procs, she's at 48 brave now, uh, that particular priest. Um, so she has a 40% chance of dodging, but yep. So this one's going to be over. We're just waiting for the killing blow. Yep. <laughs> Random damage. Wow. So nice job, Castia. Um, so yeah, we'll swap this out again. We're going to go to sing. Battle song. Excellent. And then we'll do... Uh, what was it? Grog kill. F81. Yeah. We might we might get like a battle song or something. It's hard to say. I mean, he was able that monk was able to get um the monk was able to get uh I mean a haste proc in, so he might be able to get uh, a battle song in. We'll see if it makes a difference. But yeah, just these teams are slugging it out immediately. Um, dead off the bat. Yep, that low HP pool as mentioned before. Um. Yeah, we gonna get uh, any sleeps? Oh, we got a double sleep. That blows right there. Yeah, because that just shuts down half the offense. Now, thankfully, there's a stick magic, but yeah, that just puts my team on the back burner. Um, yeah, so it doesn't even look like Battle Song has made that much of a difference. Oh man, a four minutes. Oh my god, this is huge. Holy shit! <laughs> yeah, I think those um. I think that they're just going to go bop the shit out of people now with, uh, their, yep. <laughs> yep, their two-handed, uh, flails just bopping the shit out of people. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, we didn't even get any procs whatsoever. We got, um, we got a double sleep proc instantaneously. Jesus. Yeah, even with Bad Compat, he's still got, yeah, they're just easy pickings. All right, now RNG played in my favor there, but I don't think it matters too much. Yeah, yeah, there's just no fucking way. <laughs> wow, so this has only been 15 minutes. We're four rounds in. Jesus, what a big difference that makes when uh, Sleep Rocks hit and whatnot. Oh, man, just a slugfest between these two teams.
Without question. Yeah. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> wow. What a fucking slugfest between our teams. So, congrats, Castia, and this uh, second best of three. I just figured that... Um, I, want, I, I, I just wanted to experiment, and I didn't even see the battle songs take place at all. I think, honestly, the large cemetery, the fact that the units were able to get in range right away, and he's able to go for a max range earth slash. But, uh, no, it really just goes to show you how much of a difference it makes when status effects do or do not hit. Because, yeah, three out of four people being incapacitated, it is not easy. <laughs> it's, yeah, it, it is close to impossible to win odds like that. But, all right, with that being said, I'll see you guys for the next uh, video, whenever that may be, or whoever the competitors are. Take care until then.